Web cookies are small text files that servers create and then store in the web browser on the client computer. Cookies are usually plain text and consist of name value pairs. What is unique is that when the browser makes a request to the domain server which has previously set a cookie in the browser, the browser automatically sends the cookie back to the server every time a request is made. To learn more about cookies, visit the official php.net website using the shown URL. In this video, I will show the creation of a simple cookie using PHP that will be used to greet the returning site visitor. When the browser interacts with the server, if the cookie is present, a greeting will be shown. Begin by opening the Accounts controller. Scroll down to the registration process and locate the area where the successful registration process is occurring. Within this code, just prior to setting the success message, Create a new first name cookie as shown. Consult the documentation to understand what each of the four elements of the cookie creation do. You can also consult the course materials for more explanations. Once written, save the controller. When the client registers, the cookie will be set and stored in the browser. You can view the cookie by using the Web Developer Tool and clicking the Cookies tab and View Cookie Information. With the cookie set, code can now be written to use the cookie's information. In the main site controller, I will add some code to see if the cookie exists. If so, I will collect and store its value. Remember that cookies are stored on and editable by the client. As such, they must always be filtered and sanitized. Remember, never trust anything coming from the browser. Open the common header file next. To the left of the existing My Account link, I will enter code that will check for the existence of the cookie's value and build a welcome greeting using it again if it exists. Once written, I will register a new client and return to the home view. The cookie greeting should be present. If needed, some CSS will need to be written to make the greeting appear correctly, regardless of screen size. Cookies are useful, but should never be used for sensitive information, as they are always visible to the client and editable by the client. Remember, too, that they should never be trusted. 